so 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 What's going on, everybody? My name's Chris, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Eternal Darkness. Last episode, we made it to this crazy door where there's a crazy monk behind it, probably gonna, about to crazily kill us. Um, off screen, after the last episode ended, I actually went and got all the other spells that, uh, I got the five point versions of every other spell, besides the Summon Trapper, where I don't even have the three point spell of it, apparently. Uh, all I did mostly was shields, um, uh, and I think recover. I think those are the only two left I had to do, actually. Um, so yeah, those are all done. Uh, might as well cast the shield. This guy is assigned with a zeal attack, and whatever the red version of that is called seems to overpower it. So we're gonna use that, and then we're also going to enchant an item. Six point spell. Haha, uh, <laughs> there we go. Now let's go kick some monkey butt. It's finally time to kick some tail. Let's go. Yes, let's go. We already, we already read that last episode, so we're not going to do it again. Here we go. Maybe. Oh, cool. Oh, are we going to get to fight this guy? I hope we are. I want to kick his butt. This looks cool. Hey, that's my name. <laughs> I'm Paul. Can we get that reference? Hey, that's me. Should I, should I have filled up my sanity? Oh man, I probably should have. Because I'm clearly going insane right at this very moment, so... Is this going to be a boss battle? I feel this is going to be our first actual boss battle. Or maybe this is just going to end. Holy crap! No, we've seen this before in a cutscene, haven't we? Oh, we did, yeah. Um, what's his face summoned it? Augustus. This is the one that seeks to do combat with me. Yes. Your task, my liege and greater guardian, is to guard this place. Do not worry about this world. This kind yelps and hey! at the sight of your mightiness. Probably should have seen that We will that dispose coming. of him ourselves. <laughs> Are you serious? Dude, I did all that preparation for nothing. If I am to guard this place, then I will do it as I see fit. Be gone. Leave me. And I will guard this artifact as you have instructed. How the hell are we supposed to fight this thing at the end of the game? Maybe not even the end, but I mean, come on! It's a freaking immortal god! I could apparently just explode heads whenever I freeze like it. Well, that was kind of well, it wasn't anticlimactic, but I mean, I want to actually fight something for once. A boss, that would be cool. This is always the same cutscene with her looking and swinging her head up. No, from Edward. Where do we find that? Whoa, that was cool. The camera shifts at the last second. I'm not reads. My dearest Alex, I'm glad that you have followed my paper trail this thus far. I knew. I could depend on you. Uh, this will be the hardest part of your journey. Look for the 88 keys. Continue your journey to the past. Your loving grandfather. And what the hell? The 88 keys. The 88 keys. What? I d what? I'm supposed to find 88 keys? How? Is this book a key? The book that randomly flies around for no real reason other than to be a ghosty? How the balls? Does that have something to do with this room? I can't even examine that anymore for some reason. Adjust me. I don't want it. Any... Yeah, I don't know what that. I, I still don't understand a word of that. I'm sure that'll come in use later. Oh, it does. <laughs> so otherwise, I'd be one confused at some point. Uh, is, this the, is there 88 family members or something stupid like that? No. There's not 88 names on there. Don't be redonk a donk. Redonk a donk. Do, 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 do. Can I just go in the basement? The door is locked. I just can't, like, you know, use dispel lock spell. Uh, what's the spell? Or what's the um, unlocking spell in Harry Potter? 
I don't remember. Can I just answer this phone? No, I can't just answer this phone. That would be great, though. Ah. Is there a key in here? Hello, keys? Is there any keys in here? Ooh. <laughs> what was that? Oh, that's a... Oh, Z is a reload button, apparently. I did not know that. I was kind of pressing it randomly. For some reason, I thought it would bring up a camera. Silly me, right? Um... What are you freaking out about, woman? Yes, I'll play the piano. <gasps> Ooh! Yay, randomly finding things! I completely forgot. Oh, nice! Maybe the 88 keys are all the chapters. Maybe there's 88 chapters? I mean, we're only 8 hours in this game. Apparently, it's like a 60 hour game. So, I mean, that's pretty crazy. A forbidden city. Oh, no! Oh, no! Oh, no. The forbidden city. That sounds terrible. Hey, no, this is not Augustus. This is his time. Who are you? I mean, Augustus. Is I am your people. lord and conqueror. What manner of forsaken being are you? That's so, Augustus. You can see me in my true form. You are a gifted man. Take this one and use him as the foundation for the pillar. What? <laughs> special. What a great fate. Be given a special place among the suffering. Well, that's nice of him. He's so considerate. No wonder everybody loves him. All right, let's read it. Much has been written about the exploits of conquerors. In the context of history, one man's champion is another man's nemesis, hero or murderer. Much has been written, but what has not is far more interesting. The Tome of Eternal Darkness mentions a Venetian artist and architect of the Renaissance named Roberto Bianchi. Roaming abroad to find inspiration, he was captured by a warlord expanding his empire. He forced Roberto to use his architectural and engineering skills to construct a monument to his greatness. To complete his task, he must survey the site. Middle East, 1460 AD. Back on the Middle East we go. Man, it looks like there's a giant sun in the sky in the, Survey the site 1400s. Quickly, dog, and maybe you'll live long enough to see the sacrament's construction. Maybe. Oh, is this the dude we're playing as now? Did you think we would trust you, Bianchi? Even though you are graced with the generosity of our liege, you are still his prisoner. As I said, finish your work quickly, and maybe we'll drag you out of this hole. Maybe, no promises. Oh, so sad. Roberto must survey the ruins of this ancient temple. Why is his name Rob 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 Roberto? Roberto. Roberto. There is no schema survey can be found on the map. Only when these areas have been inspected can the construction begin. Torch. Oh, cool. I got a torch. Yeah. Yeah. Um. Uh. This, are these just uh, just all of them? Is that just, just all of them? Okay. Uh. You know, let's let's just save real quick. I, I you know, might as well save, right? We don't want to pull a. We don't want to do what happened last time. Ooh, examine. Let's examine. Uh-huh. Foundation of the monument has been constructed, but has suffered some damage. Suffering some catash. The rest of the uh, complex is unknown, or but Patrol must discover if the construction can continue. 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 Alright, let's go. I'm sure we'll be lighting plenty of mummies on fire eventually. Climb up! Uh oh Hey, this place is familiar. We fought those... Um, evil things in here before. Can we talk to him? Can we actually talk instead of like just getting like a narration of what they're thinking? Like, hey, these guys terrified. A fanatic, frantic worker looking for answers to questions that can't be answered. He hopes Roberto is there to save them and longs to see his family and friends once he escapes. <laughs> it's not gonna happen. You're dead, sir. You're gonna die a very stressful death. Uh, I feel bad for you, or I would, but I'm too busy. 
Should I say well, I don't know. I thought I could maybe light that on fire to be like a Zelda. Do 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 do. You lit the torch. Yay! That means good things can happen. Uh, can I examine anything here? It doesn't look like. Look at my, look at my stupid face. Urgh! I look angry. With everything. Oh no! What? Oh hi. Okay. Construction can't continue. We have an evil zombie here. Burn, baby, burn. Disco Inferno! Thank God, you just kinda died. You are dead, right? You're dead? Are you dead? Blink out of existence? Well, it's blinking black. That's new. I never noticed that before. <laughs> the death animations are funny in this game. Can I examine that? Why can't I just, you know, that'd be nice. I wish every character had a torch on them. That'd be great. Wouldn't it be nice? Hey, there's a dead guy here. One of Roberto's fellow slaves lies dead. His wounds seem to have attracted the attention of the beasts, for they have not open have been not open, spilling his innards into the dusty floor. I'm amazed that like Roberto over here wasn't like shocked to see a weird mummy walking around. I mean, he these guys don't seem too concerned about anything. Hey, is this a uh, rune? Crossbow bolts, man. Um. The world tries to survey this area. The structure around here shows signs of stress. It is far from sound. Perhaps with some reinforcement, we might be able to seek the requirements of the monument. Well, I mean, that's kind of what you guys are doing, right? That's why they're adding pillars. That's thus why they're adding pillows. Where is this? Ooh, a safe. Never heard of that one before. Looks cool though. Any curved sword I see like that, or curved like you know weapon like that, just just makes me think of a scimitar, which makes me think of RuneScape. Sounds like the main weapon everyone used for the longest time in RuneScape, before they could you know get an abyssal whip. <laughs> that's not even like random jumbled words too. If you haven't played RuneScape, like that, that's that's all legitimate. All right, let's jump down here. Um. So far, it's just seemed like a very linear path. Are these crypts? Oh, we just we just throw dead mummy bodies in here. Okay, that that all makes sense. That's all fine, well, and dandy. Let us see near the gate. Should we move to the level? Oh, I wonder what's gonna happen here. Are all of them gonna open? Oh, okay, it's just gonna be one at a time. Okay, that's okay. Dude, come on. Huh. I will hit you with my torch, you ass dick. Yeah, that's what I thought. Mess with me for the last time, Buzz Lightyear, restore command. There we go, now he's stuck in a quarter. <laughs> uh, whew. Uh oh, I'm gonna run away now. Ah, I'm trapped! Ah! Okay, thankfully that was the smallest shockwave ever. Yay, let's open the next one where we will fight. God dang, three of these assholes, how? How are we supposed to do this without a weapon? Alright, let's just do it the best we can. <laughs> You're supposed to fight these guys with nothing but a torch. Was there a weapon I missed? I don't think so. All right, come on. Uh -huh. Slowly, I will defeat you, you ass butts. Let's run a bit. There we go. This guy's gonna die eventually, right? <laughs> this is so dumb. Oh yeah, they have friendly fire though. Maybe I should just let them hit each other. Come on. Oh, what? They even hit each other! Uh, P. Uh. Come on, seriously? They haven't even fallen yet. I'm pretty sure they gotta fall once before I can kill them. And they, they fall once and they get up again, you know? That's what it seemed to have been. <laughs> seriously? This day forever! Oh, God. Uh oh. Get off of me. I ended somehow. Oh, I got a. I'm stupid. I got a save. I completely forgot I got that. Oh, wow. Okay. Okay. I feel stupid. Don't I just feel the stupids now? Well, I mean, that was pretty great. I was fighting these assholes with a freaking torch. I mean, come on. That's pretty impressive, right? I, I suck with this, man. Can I kill this guy now? Yeah. No. Probably wasn't worth it to get that sanity and lose all that health assistance. Uh, sure, let's pull it. I think, it's gonna be, I think there's more bad guys behind here, but let's 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 see. Yep, there's only more bad guys. They're gonna get up. 
There you go. Now finish you. Yay, now let's grab my torch for now. Yay, I did it! Yay, now let's freaking equip my safe. No, just to be safe! <laughs> ah. <laughs> just kidding. That, I love that joke. That was great. Uh, let's run by real quick. There we go. Um, I mean, you guys can kind of see from the torchlight, right? Oh, he burns my head! You see that guy's like reaching for his non existent head. What a silly. At least he can't see me. What? How can he hit me when he can't even see me? Just randomly swing your freaking crazy ass arms around. Alright. I should probably call an episode here. With all these guys that, once again, don't really seem too concerned with anything. Oh, man. Thank you guys so much for watching this episode. Of Let's play Eternal Darkness. Hey, look, it's a crossbow. In the next one, we will continue through this place, I guess. I'm looking up randomly. Hey, oh, excuse me. Thank you guys so much for watching. Take care guys later. Bye-bye. Say goodbye, Mr. Roberto. Bye.